Hey guys, this is a review of the Pacific Sun Triton S LED 145 watts. This is what it looks like. I have it hung on the wall, on the ceiling. Um, in the back here, are these two switches. The first one, that's to turn the display on and off. So if you switch it up, uh, the display goes on, and then the other one is just the soft reset button. So here's the display. Uh, it does display the uh, temperature in Celsius. This is, uh, I think, like a European product. A sunset duration, two hours. Right now I have it set to 25%. Uh, it has the time. I have it set for sunset to start at 10 o'clock, I believe. Alright, so this is what all the uh, lights turned up. There's nine different lights, no white LEDs, and uh, all nine, it's nine channel control. So you could control all nine lights. I'll show you guys that in a bit. These are the coils I moved about half an hour ago from my old tank. There. Might be going up the sale soon. Okay. I really like the light. It looks cool. Um, has like a bit of a, uh, I guess like a violet uh, look to it. But you could change that to make it look any way you want. These are my two little guys, I don't know if they, yeah, they just, I put them in here like an hour ago, so I guess they're just getting used to it. I hope they're okay. I got my skimmer out there. I have to cut a hole around the net for the skimmer to fit. Okay. Right, let's talk a little bit about the software here, how you control the lamp. Really easy. So I have a netbook. Uh, you need a uh, external uh, blue uh, Bluetooth adapter. It's fifteen dollars. I'm using a uh, what is it called? An ex uh, storage drive, a USB drive. Just because I don't have a CD drive, so I had to put the uh, CD that comes with it. This I got. You know, I put it on my friend's computer, and then I put it on the memory stick and that's it so yeah so here we're, pre we're pressing connect to the lamp com 3 does the port where the uh, thing is plugged into see on the bottom here it's, a, it's something to connect it's been completed successfully that's it alright now we could go into various things here general settings daytime Manual overwrite. The various acclimation modes. Depending on what you have. It's going to daylights daylight settings. You can set everything here. What time you want the sunrise to start? Sunset. These do not have the T5 setting. They are also coming out with the Bali feature, which for these lights very soon the update will be up, uh, will be available. I was told in about a, a month or so. A week tweak. It's uh, for days where you're, for example, you're home and you want to enjoy your tank more at a certain time. So you could, you know, for example, on Tuesday, you could set it to uh, if you go two down, then it'll s start two hours earlier than it normally would. Or if you go two up, you know, it'll start two hours later and end two hours later. So, depending on what you want, let's go into the color settings. This is what a real fun is you know, if you could control each one of these lights you have cyan, amber, UV, royal blue. 
another oil blue. A moon blue, green, and orange red. Okay, and uh, you know, for those of you that also ask the same question, well, what if, what if you want to get, you know, make your tank look white? As if you have white LEDs, you know, like the uh, whatever spectrum that is, 10,000K, I think. Well, all you have to do is you turn every all of them down except for the uh, amber and cyan, I believe, <laughs> and then your tank will look white. You know, the look that you want, even for uh, for the you know, f if you want like fresh water, you want that yellowish look. You could also you know achieve that here. So pretty much any color you could think of, uh, you know, you could you know you could play with it. And then all you have to do is just press set color, and it'll do that. All right, now you have par table. This is, gets a little more sophisticated. You get, you know, could really tweak it. You know, for each color. If you wanted to, uh, you know, go up throughout the day at different times and different intensities or whatever. I am not really playing around with this too much. But uh, the cool thing about it is, you know, people that do play with it, they uh, they could set, you know, send us the uh, the par. Uh, settings and then we could achieve that effect you know so I think that's basically what the Bali program is it's a just they measure different intensities of each color throughout the day of Bali in Bali when they did the research there and they programmed that into here so that'll be available soon okay all right so moonlights you can set them to whatever mine are actually set to four so if you press read to show, show you what yours are. Press read, see four. That's the settings that I put on. And then you could put, you know, change it if you want to. And put it, uh, it goes all the way up to 100, and then you can just press save. And just a couple of more settings here. Whatever. Reset. A whole bunch of all of that stuff. Alright. So this is what it looks like with everything up. And I'll do more videos once I play with the uh, intensities. So it's a 25%. I hope these guys are alright. Yeah, my corals are loving this light so far. So we'll see. Alright, thanks for watching guys. As always let me know what you think, comments below. And uh see you next time.